I'm joined by not one but two Coronation Street stars, real life couple Sally Carmen, who plays Abby, and Joe Dettine, who is Tim, of course. They've had some really exciting news in lockdown. They got engaged. Congratulations. How are you? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's fantastic. Wow. It's really good. So, you guys obviously met on set. Yeah. And just clicked. Well, yeah, slowly. <laughs> <laughs> Friends uh, for, for a, a while, um, but then we started sharing puddings and that's when I thought maybe something was on the boil. Right, uh, yes, exactly. Over, I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say the pudding because it's too naughty, but yes, exactly, that makes <laughs> absolute sense. I like that very much. So you don't share too many scenes together though, but is that no. better, do you think? Does that work out a wee bit better? Oh yeah, yeah, um, uh, it's, it's, it's much better <laughs> just because it, uh, Johnny um, is a bit of a joker and he's very funny and he can put you off your stride. You um, did live with him, didn't I you? I did. I lived with the horse in the back room for a bit. We shared a room with the horse. Yeah. So uh, that was that was, that was was all right. Lots of people tend to live at the Metcalf. They just sort of <laughs> come in from the front door and they don't leave. Well, indeed. Now, look, mm -hmm. there might be a Corrie wedding on the cards, obviously for Tim and Sally, because he accidentally, didn't he, accidentally got married before and then kind of forgot yeah. about it, as you do. Very easily done, very easily yeah. done. So there might be, oh, who's that? Who's that? Is that your wee dog? Oh, this is pudding. Beautiful. Oh, what are we like? Oh, yeah, oh, he's very... He's gorgeous. Keeping you sane, I'll bet, during all of this, taking out for walks and things like that. <laughs> yeah, he's keeping you sane, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm sitting on his squeaky toy right now. That's why he's sitting on Sally's knee, which yeah. is trying to keep him quiet. Yeah. You have to be, well, just be careful where you perch your buttock and it doesn't do, you know, doesn't do a squeaky noise. Or it'll, be, it'll be all over you, it'll be all over you. Big week, of course, big week for both of your characters. Um, yeah. Joe, fine, for goodness sake, now, I'm, I'm not going to say that light bends round Tim because he's so dense, but it has yeah. taken a while <laughs> for the penny to drop. Yeah, well, you know, he's in denial about his father, you know. Um, it, it, everybody kind of thinks that, you know, they're, they're kind of, world revolves around their own family, don't they? And, you know, to, 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 to begin to, you know, suspect anything negative of his father is, is the last thing that he's going to do. No, that's true. And as we heard, Paula Wilcox is going to be joining you as an ex-partner of Jeff's. Yes. That's, a, yeah. that's a brilliant idea. It would be really good to see her again. And that's going, to, that's going to be a whole new aspect. I know you can't say very much about what she's going to do, but yeah. there will be fireworks. Yeah, yeah, no, I met her in the canteen the other week. She seems like a nice lady. <laughs> That's good. And how has oh, it been? And look, I know, I know. How has it been being back at work, you two? Has it been good? Are you, were you desperate to get back? Yeah, we yeah. were. We were desperate yeah. to get back. Um, and we, we've never been so grateful to, to be working, to be honest, to so many of our friends and, and, and who not aren't. Uh, but it's been brilliant. They've, they've, Corey have really, they've handled it perfectly. They've um, put every sort of uh, safety aspect in place. Yeah, and they've done a brilliant job. It's, it's been so smooth and it's actually really enjoyable because we're getting to do a lot of like two, three-handers, um, which is just lovely as an actor to be able to do that. So we're, we're really enjoying ourselves. The canteen's not <laughs> which is a bit of a downer. Is it not? Is it not open at all? Do you have to bring no. in your own sandwiches? Yeah, well, not quite. Yeah, there's not as much selection. Oh, is, that's it, terrible. You poor wee thing. I don't know how you <laughs> manage. I do not. So, Sally, Abby, tell me about Abby. She's an interesting one, isn't she? Do you think yeah. you, the two of you, if she was real, that the two of you could be friends? No, no. I've, I've, I've got... <laughs> she's very high maintenance and you commit to... Uh, I've, I've kind of got enough on right now. <laughs> Yeah, I, I can understand. It's, and she's got all of this going on, you know, with the adoptive parents of the twins. There's yeah. a lot there. I mean, there's, she's, she protects... But you know what about her? It's the way... Of, when you play her, yeah, there's this, like, really hard-boiled person. But really inside, there is a much softer side to her. And you, you, do, you do see that. She, she lashes out sometimes. But, you know, in, inside, she, she loves her kids. She really does. It's, it's, it's never been an issue of whether she, she loves them. She absolutely does. She's got a heart of gold. She's just emotionally extremely immature. Um, and she, she acts, you know, in, in the moment. She's very spontaneous and, 
and she doesn't think through what, what you know her actions and it has dire consequences most of the time but she doesn't mean any harm really she's just a bit explosive emotionally but she she would do anything for anyone and she's so loyal she's you know you, you've got if she if you look after her she will absolutely have your back forever so i love playing her and, and i love the fact that anything will go because a lot of characters you think well my character wouldn't do that but there's literally nothing that you know abby wouldn't do so that's it's great that, do you know what that's really true which means you can go in so many different directions you could have so many different <laughs> relationships i don't necessarily mean romantic ones but just no. relationships with all of the different characters very Absolutely. interesting very interesting can i just say looking behind you the view is absolutely gorgeous it really is you're yeah. so lucky you've got the most beautiful view there yeah oh. that's so for keys um oh, it's it, it's, you can you can actually see the Cory set from where we are if you stand up. <laughs> really? You can see your work from where you yeah. are? I love that. That means it's really yeah. easy to get in and out. So do you two, when you're at home together, do you run lines with each other? Do you help each other with lines or do you just let each other get on with it? Um, we tend to let each other get on with it. I mean, if there's if there's a situation where there are, are a lot of lines or storylines really heavy, we might run through them a little bit. But we kind of you kind of get used to doing your own thing and uh, having your own way of learning lines. So we just... You kind of need to leave work at work, really, don't you? Yeah. Yay. No, you do. You absolutely do. Well, listen, I hope you two are going to be in Coronation Street for a very, very, very long time. It's great to talk to you. Congratulations on the engagement. I look forward to hearing news of the wedding at some point, whenever that may happen, when things get back to whatever normal is. But great to see both of you. Thank you so, so much. Thank you. Thank great to see Thank you.